Hello everybody, how you doing today? This is Sakoni Prince of SakoniPrince.com where we introduce you to yourself. And then I want to ask you, what are you building on? That's right, what are you building on? You know, as a child, I used to play House of Cards and you never really knew which card was going to be the one that caused the whole thing to fall. And then we get so frustrated at times when you put in all that work, all that effort, all of that energy, and then it will fall over. And I, and I can't tell you, see, just like that. And that too. But I can't tell you how many times it took me to put this together. But you know, even that falling apart, you see that right there? Let me take the rest of these cards off. But see, I guess you can say I cheated. Because what I did was I used a good foundation. I put the cards in this box to help stabilize it. And then even in our own life, we need a good foundation. You know, the strength of any building is not shown on the outside, but on the inside. The steel beams that, that go up, but before they go up, they have to go down. Down into the earth, down into the bedrock, down into a good foundation so that what goes up can stand. And that's true even in our own life. We need to make sure that we are building our lives on a good foundation. You know, I'm reminded of a story in the Bible where Jesus talks about two people that build a house. One of them built his own sand. But the other one took the time to dig down to a good, solid foundation. And he built there. Now, yes, it took him longer to build his house. He didn't have a chance to have a housewarming so soon. But in the end, when trouble came, when the hard times came, he was able to stand. His house was able to stand because it was built on a foundation. And our lives should be the same way. We should dig down deep and get a good foundation. Maybe it's even in our education by getting a college degree or going on to get a trade, whatever it is, in order for us to have something to stand on. Even in our relationships, don't just hop up and get married. Take some time to build that foundation. Because believe it or not, the winds, they're going to blow. They're going to knock. They're going to push. They're going to be like that, 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 that wolf that huffed and puffed and blew those houses down. But when he got to the house that was made out of brick, he had a problem. Not only was it made out of brick, but it had a good foundation. Because you just can't lay bricks. You have to put them on something. That's a good foundation. So what are you building on? What foundation have you erected in your life to build a tall building? Thomas Kep said that the loftier the build, the deeper the foundation has to be laid. And if you want to build a huge structure, if you're building something big, you're going to have to spend the time to put in the right foundation. Hey, look, this is Sakoni Prince of SakoniPrince.com, where we introduce you to yourself. And today I'm asking, what foundation are you building? And hey, look, I actually would like and share this video.